Chrissy, Sam and Brownie. It's a podcast bonus. Everybody jump in glee. It's Sandy Lee. For the very last time on this show. Hey, Andy, um, I'm available for freelance work. Email me at sexyproducer69 at hotmail.com. It's Sandy Lee. It's Andy Lee. Welcome for the last time, the beautiful Andy Lee. For the last time. That's the right. I would have thought time. the last, your last appearance should have been the last time, but you're back. <laughs> no, we're getting all our faves back, so it's a thrill to see you. What have you been doing? Well, obviously, morning, your news. <laughs> it's just been, it's been constant wandering <laughs> on the beach, <laughs> occasionally looking at the dog, and the dog looks up at me and goes, why are you so sad? Yeah. And she, she doesn't know. And that's no. the... Blessing of being a dog. You don't understand your favourite radio shows. You don't have to deal with the loss of your favourite radio shows. She's there for you as you process it. You've been taking your dog on the golf course. Yeah, I have. Yeah. What? I, 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 have, I have, I have, I fit in some golf in between the morning um, <laughs> yeah. of, of this show. Yeah, you got to, you got to, you got to take. Uh, you don't go out during, you know, Normally, the middle of cold. What if they do? <laughs> what if they do a poo? You yeah. pick it up. Trissy. But that doesn't seem Same right. There shouldn't even be a remnant of a poo on a golf course. There's always kangaroo Kangaroos. poos. There's rabbit poos. Sometimes my mate Hogs can't get it around. <laughs> 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 Hogs poo. <laughs> Happened more than once. Did, Thank goodness. Is for, a lead? Thanks Does goodness a lead for the, the golf uh, uh, mat or rug oh, that you have. You know, the towel. Oh. Yes. Oh, Why are you so obsessed with it? What are you, what's wrong with the, with the dog's brownie? Well, as a golf aficionado, mm. as oh, Andy really? is, and so are you are, Sam. Oh, mate, I'm, I'm almost retired. Time. I am. Um, I, would, I, I, take... would twi- I would look twice if there was a member, a fellow member on the course with a dog. <laughs> look, as in, it looked twice in admiration. <laughs> no. Yeah. no. Disgust. No. Disgust. Disgust. Oh, your heartless bastard. Can I ask your um, opinion of yeah. Summer John? Can you see that Summer John is Summer now... Jo- didn't yeah. recognise him. Yeah. The so Winter, nah. Winter John is very smart oh, and yeah. clean shaven, but Summer mm. John yes. is wild and woolly. Mm. Very much, much like Jon Snow from mm. from uh, Game of Thrones. Absolutely. Yeah. I've had a lot of compliments, apart from at home. My yes. wife. Doesn't well, like it? No. Hates it. Are you itchy? Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm getting past that phase, though. I'm also... Yeah. Congratulations on very limited greys. Mm, there's a few uh, greys coming. Yeah, I know, yes. not too but bad. limited. No. Yeah. Mine's full grey. I've tried to grow a beard, and mine's full grey. Is it? But Is with it? with a black moustache, so it's like a top deck <laughs> Capri. <laughs> <laughs> well, You're that's, like a that's, schnauzer. Yeah. Schnauzer. That's also the issue with my, well, no, mine's not even. Mine's just grey. Just like, grey. Remember, you yeah, know, yeah. Gets so upset. well done. Whenever okay, you know, if we come back from summer and Jack gets gets upset, yeah, and you go, you look like Mr Miyagi shaving that <laughs> off. You go, mate, I'm leaving it. I love summer, summer, summer. Sam. I yeah. love summer, Sam. Just stays around. The reason Brownie is, isn't so grey is that you're a very young man. Thank you, Krista. I mean, are... <laughs> we've known you. We've known you for so long. You should be seventy-five, but you're mm. only forty something, forty-two or something, are you? 41. I'm forty-one. Forty-one. I've never seen I'm, for, I'm forty-one. Very young. You look young. I mean. You look young. <laughs> so, mate, never... you haven't got three kids, though. Okay, so That's I'm, I'm handicapped. I'm carrying a big weight, mate. I'm not <laughs> yes. the top weight. Uh, I've prepared prepared something for you guys. Yes. What? Okay. In your Why? I'm well, I, yeah, I know exactly. As I was, in morning. As I was on my way in here, I was like, if these guys aren't putting any effort in, why the hell should I? <laughs> <laughs> How very dare you? <laughs> You've been listening then. So, um, you know, at the end of well, a lot of crime shows like uh, Line of Duty, yes. end of uh, Real Housewives of uh, of whatever New York or whatever, mm. they often at the end of the episode of the series, they will say, "This person went on to do this." Yes. And That's my person... favourite part of any film. Any film, it's you're good, isn't finding it? out you're what. For it. And yeah. I figured, obviously, this show's finishing up. So, what's going to happen to the main characters? Oh. What? I know. A lot of efforts going on. You bet. I can post this music myself. <laughs> <laughs> that was the real time. In your you period of mourning. Yes. Chrissy Swan would travel to Vienna for the World Auto Q Championships. Only to be beaten by fellow Australian Peter Hitchner in the semi final. God damn you, Hitch. Peter famously said to Chrissy as they shook hands at the end of the bout If you're going to take a shot at the king, make sure you don't miss, <laughs> bitch. <laughs> That's classic. Fabulous. That's classic, Hitch. Jonathan Brown would return home to Kylie and the kids after five years of constant work, only to find out, like the film Castaway, 
Carly had moved on with another man. <laughs> Thinking Jonathan was dead. <laughs> so far Jonathan from the was dead. <laughs> that man would be Darren McMullen. <laughs> you had plenty of time for Carly after the real love boat didn't return. <laughs> The kids, <laughs> That's the, kids, the kids now have Scottish accents, which is considered a considerable upgrade given the way Brownie sounds. <laughs> <laughs> they might be able to understand that more than they can understand most. This is magnificent. Can I'm imagine, enjoying this. Imagine Darren McMullen in your life. Yeah. No, not in his life. In yeah. Kylie's life. Done now. Deep in Kylie's life. It's okay. Life. You know what? I'm happy with that. You're living, okay. at, you're living at the Olsen now. You're fine. Yeah. 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 You're out. What was that golf tournament you played in again here? Yeah, the big PGA championships. You're welcome. Two more characters in this great story. Dino and Sam Pang's working relationship would continue. With Sam asking Dino to join him on his national comedy tour. Mm. Dino would be required to add applause and laugh sound effects at Sham- <laughs> Sam's shows if there was none. Dino would be a very, very busy man. <laughs> yes. Yes. That is magnificent. Yes. Well done. Well done. Hey, well done. Andy, wow. for seven years of coming in, we, we thank you, mate. It's been so much fun. So <laughs> much fun coming in. Have guys. you got anything to plug? You've done a lot for this show. Over Please, the 100 back. 100's back in the new year. Yes, we start that soon. And... Uh, Oh, kids' books out there. Nothing, really. Hamish and Andy podcast. That's, that's, yes. uh, that's, picking up, uh, it's more just being here. Picking up Henrietta's Congratu- poo off the golf yes. course. Congratulating you guys on an amazing show. I've had a number of people come up to me, uh, not celebrities, so I won't name them, but say that they your is their favourite show and they're going to miss it greatly. In fact, I had to break the news to someone. Oh. I was overseas uh, for work and um, one of the people I was travelling with, I said, she said, oh, Chrissy Sam and Brownlee is my favourite show. And I said, oh, you realise they're finished? Mm. And she was shocked. Ruined yeah. a whole trip. Um, well, that, makes, um, yeah, that, whole makes, trip. that makes me happy that the trip was ruined as well. <laughs> <laughs> not, only, not only the bad news that you had to break and then that it was ruined as well. Uh, no, congrats, guys. I, it's res- been awesome we really today. do appreciate the fact you've come in because I remember when we started the show, it was a big, you know, you were a, obviously a, you know, a star of a rival network mm, mm. and you, you were coming on our show was a big thing. We really yeah, appreciate it. Not anymore. It. No, not it's now. Tiny, tiny thing now, mm. but uh, back back in the day. If anything, if our stage, you're welcome, but we're fine. It's all good. The show will be back tomorrow. Chrissy, Sam and Brownie. Oh, unless it's a weekend. Here's the 100.